all around there. Cracks here. Put a weld an edge on it. And there's the handrail. A few other things. Nice little job. There's gouge, I'm probably gonna reposition to do that, but we're gonna hog a real hot 60 10 in to get the root cooking and then grind that down and 70 18 are out. That was under a well that was apparently fixed by the other guy. The dwelling, I thought I seen a little crack. I grinded it, the crack went away. I don't know. I took the gouger. Then I started gouging just below the surface of that well. The crack was all the way through and went up. Can't uh, can't detect cracks with the grinder. You gotta gouge. And the guy before was just grinding a little bit and welding on top. That's why I just kept cracking and cracking and cracking. You need to gouge it. Patching it up just waste time. So I gotta gouge this more. This whole crack out and fix this thing right. When you gouge, it opens the crack up and you can see it. When you grind, it kind of just like mashes the metal in and it'll, it'll hide the crack. So that, that was an already fixed repair right there. Yeah, that was a previous repair. Went all the way up to there. But it all spider cracked out because it only half fixed it. Well, I'm ending up putting so much well down, taking so much time because the last guy that was in there, the guy that's been coming around, they said like when he come do a repair, he'd just be there and he'd be show up and be gone again in an hour. And he was just grinding down a little bit and just putting a old weld over the crack and taking off. So now the weld, just more weld, 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 weld. None of the cracks are repaired properly. It was all spider crack everywhere, so. You can't really chase cracks with a grinder. You can't. Because you start grinding in, it kind of mashes the metal over. And sometimes you can see the crack. A lot of times it'll hide it. If you really want to find cracks, you got to use a gouger. And, like, if you hire someone to show up to repair cracks on a piece of heavy equipment, and he doesn't have an air compressor and a gouger, you might as well just tell him to leave because he's wasting your time. Oh, it's frustrating. So, anyways, you would think something like that you show up once to repair cracks you repair cracks you come back again and it's cracked again you'd look at it and be like okay we're gonna add braces how can i make this better maybe i just cut out some old crap and put some new metal in or something you don't just show up put a weld on leave show up put a weld on like just don't keep doing that that's ridiculous and dumb so i'm gonna try to put some extra braces on that and get all the welds fixed or cracks fixed and uh, yeah sun came out it's a nice day this is one of the rolled units dang looks like it got a little hot <laughs> yeah so i'm in a dump so uh all the steel has to be salvaged from the dump that i want to use on the equipment so I had a torch cut a couple chunks uh, here and it's all paper and cardboard and foam so hopefully uh, nothing caught on fire. Oh yeah, that's some good metal right there. <laughs> that's, that's stuff I got to work with. Hopefully I get two straight chunks out of it. Oh my goodness, look at these. What kind of psychopath throws out Tonka toys? 
So the previous guy was asked to put gussets in and all he put was these craps. So I beefed up the welds on those. I cut these gussets out. So now I'm just gonna fire it up and test run it to see if those gussets are gonna be in the way. I don't see why they would be, but. Well, yeah, that thumb doesn't even go up very high anyways. If you put anything there, it wouldn't be in the way. Yeah, that clears everything. I think that's about all, all it's got. I didn't think it'd be in the way of anything. I just wanted to check it. So, okay. Well, maybe I'll weld it up in this position. That looks nice. Cool. Dang, that took a long time. That ate the whole day up. Weld that edge back on. You know. Weld those gussets in. They look pretty sweet. I was thinking about putting something from here across, but I don't think, I think it's good. Out of time anyways, so. Oh, insane amount of welding there. So, uh, yeah. Just, uh, there's a solid, like, you can even see, like, that gobby weld. And there's, like, that big chunk of undercut beside it and like it was just all cracks everywhere because of these crappy old wells like look at that i should do something with that but i'm out of time so yep lots and lots of welds hopefully with those gussets and all those welds it lasts for a little bit longer this time cool well that's uh awesome I got another job somewhere tomorrow too. Tomorrow's Saturday, but I got to take away I can get it. Right on, guys. Thanks for watching, and uh, we'll see you on the next one. Looks like a battle scene here. Dude, look at this thing. A rally chopper. Dang. Whoa. Now that... There's a unit. Whew. Wow. Bye, little buddy. See you later.